YouTube just uh, doing an update on my RC build um, so I've got one of the uh, nacelle pods done it has no EDF um, what I've got set up here is a reverse thrust mechanism so that's uh, reverse thrust and that is closed so as you can see it's not lined up all the way but it's not that big of a deal um, as long as it's not hindering the thrust that's going in and coming out the back which that might be an issue um, we'll see I need to do some tests I don't have an EDF here yet so and then closed and open so as you can see I've got a lot of bugs to work out to see if I can get this thing to work properly um, it doesn't weigh anything the key of it is trying to keep it light um, I've seen videos of guys uh, making it with um, what is it uh, the 3d printers and stuff uh, it looks like it it weighs a lot so in order to get this thing to fly scale you want to keep it as light as possible so that's why I'm using nothing but foam and it's a lot harder to do that because you've got to get everything to to work out right you know making slide rails out of foam is difficult because it's just complicated so you really need to take the time to try to figure out how to do it but this doesn't weigh anything um, so I'm sure that it'll work but it's a matter of getting everything to function correctly so that it can work so once again uh, here we go with the closed or excuse me open open Reverse thruster. Um, this will be my first one. If it doesn't work, you won't see it on the airplane. If it does work, you'll see it on the airplane. So, you guys take care and enjoy.